Hello ladies and hello gentlemen. It is Atten here today. What I will be doing very quickly is showing you how you can extract GMA files. As many of you may or may not know, when Gary's Mod 13 was released, the um, Face Punch decided to make all these files .gma so you can't access them or do much with them. Now, there is a way that you... Well, really, the problem here is that for a lot of people, they can't edit these files, can't really do much with them. So, with Gary's Mod, is that there's a thing called the GW Tool. Now, this is available on um, Gaddons. And allows you to basically, um, you can download here, you can basically just open these, like extract these and work with them. What it allows you to do is to edit the script, fix any bugs, and even republish should the author of the um, add-on or script or whatever decide to, you know, just nick off and never come back. Um, <clears throat> now, many people might call me a dirty pirate for this, but... I like to have control over the add-ons I have on my computer and I'd like to review them and learn from them and actually have the ability to say alright this is my add-on and blah 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 well not my add-on but when I download but nonetheless you basically start up GW tool and you get this window now I've got this open on my desktop so you just drag the add-on file right here and it should extract like so that's basically the contents of the file and you can just go in here and you can really get information about the add-on is so on and you can you know you just go over from here you got the lure files weapons gmod tool s tools wait and from here you can basically edit change or do whatever you can even fix bugs so if you've been looking like trying to find out how you can do this then um, the gw tools should help you like in um, extracting these files. However, I am sure that there is a software that, that might be better than this. I'm not s certain, but this does the job perfectly well, and I've had no issues with it. But anyways, I'm going to let you guys go now, and that's just how you can open these files.